Hey, I'm Papa Sean. This is Star Wars Jedi Survivor, and we are in the Pylon Saloon. Alright, so we haven't explored this place yet, so let's take a look. My old scrapper outfit. Why did Grease keep this? I know. Creepy. That Sears Helix set. I wonder why it ended up here. Kobo's pretty far from the nearest trade route. Looks like Grease makes do with salvage. A workbench. Your modifications couldn't hurt. Anything new for you? Apart from changing the look, and I, I kind of like the uh, little antenna sticking out there, I don't think that these are doing anything. That should do it. Doesn't look like there's any stat increase. And there's a bed. Talking in your sleep, huh? Guess some things never change. Weirdo. Hairball. <laughs> Thanks for letting me crash here. Of course. Why do you think I've kept your stuff around all these years? I was hoping you'd stop by and maybe take a break. You both know what happens when I stay in one place too long. You said there's a spare gyro around here somewhere? We've got plenty of time to fix the madness. You are what I want to talk about. I'm fine. The sooner we get moving, the better. And then what? You're going to go find some trouble with Saw Guerrera? Maybe. Yeah. One of us has to keep fighting. That's funny. That's the exact same thing you said the day we all split up. Yeah, because I... Listen. I know you all had your reasons for leaving. But walking away isn't an option for me. I have to hold the line. And where's that guy, your cow? Look, I wish things were different, but you keep losing people. And you yourself said that the Empire's growing stronger every day. Now, maybe it's time for you to be something more than a lightsaber. Think about yourself. Settle down. Find a home. What? Home, Grease? There is no home. Home was the order. It was my teacher. It was everyone I lost. What does their sacrifice mean if I go and I just give up and stick my head in the sand? I know you were dealt a bad hand, but you gotta take it from me. Somebody who had to learn the hard way. You gotta know when to walk away from a rigged game. Otherwise, you are gonna end up losing something you could never replace. Now you go ahead and look. I keep a lot of spare parts down there. I'm sure you'll be able to find whatever you need to get the manis up and running. Thanks. I appreciate all this. Kyle, can I tell you one thing? It's really good seeing you again. Yeah, you too. Grease. I'll think about what you said. Hey, uh, watch your step down there. Be careful. <laughs> I definitely have a pest problem.
cold smuggling tunnels, huh? Gray's always kept a few secrets up his sleeve. Oh, I saw something just as I came in. There it is. Oh, nice. Find something, buddy? What spook grease? You're okay, bud. Have you been spooking grease down here? That's it. Right, how do we get through that, huh? Oh, looks like there's a spot over here. Okay, looks like it just straight up gave us a skill point. Not bad. Careful around here, bud. Nobody's used these tunnels for a long time now. Looks like we are on the other side of that green force field. Maybe we can shut it off. Leave it to Grease to take another person's junk and add more junk. Close enough. Just won't open. Is that it? Never look when you can leap, eh? Uh. Oh. Sooner we get to Greece, the sooner we can. We should check this out. Wow. All right. Well, this brings us to a underground meditation point, collapsed passage. Hopefully, this was helpful, you guys. Till next time. Happy questing.